tech is a, a really important conversation to have with you right now. You're in the middle of this lawsuit with Google. Yeah. Explain that. So uh, the first debate that we had in this presidential election, you know, we had hoped that I would do well going into it and that people would go and start their Internet search and say, hey, who is Tulsi Gabbard? I've never heard of her before. And so we went and got, you know, got the Google ads set up, got them approved. Everything was ready to rock and roll. Uh, I was the most Googled candidate of the night, uh, as I have been for every debate that I've participated in. The issue was during that first debate, uh, you know, while, while that peak period was happening, our, our Google ad account was suspended by Google with no explanation whatsoever, was suspended by Google with no explanation whatsoever. No, like, hey, so you guys, dirty. There, there was nothing like, hey, you guys screwed up, fix this, hey, and then we'll put Google? your account back yeah, in. Hey, it's Bill. How are you? <laughs> Good to hear from y'all. That is so sketchy. It's so sketchy. And, and, it, and so, you know, our tech guys are freaking out. They're like, man, this is what we were waiting for. And now you guys took our account down. Tell us what we got to do to get it back up. And uh, A, we didn't hear back for a while. Once we started hearing back, we heard back from different people with different answers. Nothing clear cut to say you did this wrong, fix this, we'll put your account back. Nothing I'm back, nothing I'm back, nothing I'm back, nothing. And then all of a sudden, you know, hours and hours had gone by and then our, our account was reinstated without any explanation about what happened. And, you know, this is, this is bigger than just the, the loss in opportunity that, that my campaign had uh, because this happened on that night during that peak period. It's a bigger issue about the power that this corporation has in Google in interfering essentially in fair elections and in what kind of information they are willing to put in front of people. Because of provisions that were passed in the Patriot Act, there were loopholes that have been exploited by some of our tech companies um, working with some of our intelligence agencies to build these back doors into their systems, uh, into their programs, or into their hardware, which directly violates the civil liberties and Fourth Amendment rights for us uh, as Americans. And I think that points to the bigger issue of, of civil liberties and privacy uh, and the growing um, power. that we've got to be very, very, I, I, in my opinion, concerned and, and careful of, uh, and actually exercising the kind of oversight and accountability um, that we should have been doing, frankly, a long time ago.